Uh, yeah, obviously, everyone knows what happened. And uh, from my standpoint, I just wanted to say thank you to Ray Borelli and the training staffs of uh, both our team and Anaheim and the doctors and all the paramedics and uh, everybody who's who's helped me uh, that night and, and up to this point. So, um, uh, a scary thing, but uh, everything's been going pretty good lately. And um, yeah, we'll just continue to evaluate things as they go. Anybody have any questions? How do you feel? Uh, I, I'm at the point now I feel pretty good. Um, yeah, yeah, that's kind of the, the weird thing about this whole thing is you go from uh, something that happened totally out of the blue and unexpected to uh, being in the hospital for a couple of days and then now there's some restrictions as to what I can do but uh, feel pretty normal. So it's, it's a good thing. Uh, yeah, the... The outreach and the support that people have shown has been pretty overwhelming. Um, it, the actual where this took place and and uh, the people that were around at the time, uh, as well as my dad being there on the trip, uh, there were a lot of things that were absolute best case scenario. Uh, yeah, I, I, there's been a lot going on. I think that's something. I'm definitely going to have to evaluate, but uh, to say I'm, I've done that, I wouldn't say fully yet. Um, yeah, just obviously, to, there's there's things, decisions that I'm going to have to make, but uh, I'll come later. Yeah, just to help uh, or clarify, Jay and I have spoken uh, over the last week or so, and uh, we, we both understand that he won't participate this year in the regular season or playoffs for us. Uh, we talked about uh, longer term things that may or may not happen and uh, both feel that you know it's February you don't have to make you don't have to make long term decisions at this point and so he's going to take time uh, uh, again get back uh, in with his family and, and be around the team and uh, he'll address those uh, uh, things as, as the summer uh, progresses. Yeah I, again having my dad there I think really helped her and um, just to get the sort of play-by-play -play as things were happening. But, um, yeah, I mean, that's I think something like this happens. That's what you think of as your family. And, um, you know, I got young kids. They they knew something was up. They, you know, you can't really explain the specifics of something like this to them. So um, for them to, when they physically see you, it's, it's okay, he's fine, and they move on with things. And... Obviously, my wife was was happy to see me, and I was happy to see her. So, um, yeah, I, I just it's it's kind of a, been a surreal experience. Why, why, you know, what caused that uh, that sort of thing? Um, and that's you know that's kind of with the doctors and all the tests and things that they're trying to trying to pin down. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm pre I consider myself pretty fortunate, and I've I always enjoyed being active and doing that stuff. And that was really the one thing when I came out of things and realized what had happened and what the what it was going to mean going forward as far as um, getting this device implanted and all that. It was you know your lifestyle. Like, can you still do those things that you enjoy and the the outlook is that, yeah, you can. You can live a, a pretty normal life. So uh, from my viewpoint, you know, early stages, that was really my biggest concern. And it sounds like it's hopefully best case scenario and shouldn't be that much of a concern. Yeah, has there been something in life, a certain food, a certain moment that you have gone through the past couple of days and be like, God, it's so special just to be able to experience this? Uh, nothing. Not any you know, like one specific thing. I, I think just the being around my family. Um, that's that's the most important thing. I think that's what you know. Anytime you go through something like this, or your family goes through um, things with different people, you know, that's always what you realize is uh, 
Yeah, yeah. I think family and, and the things that are close to you are, you know, sometimes you lose, lose sight of things like that uh, when life gets busy, but uh, it puts things in perspective.